Look, you're confused. I know you're upset. I thought that we, we understood each other. You never really felt me. Come on, Luca! Come on! You see people in pain every day! You tell me how it feels! You know what it's like? Britney Spears' dad, Jamie, currently controls her estate and finances in an effort to get his daughter's career back on track. Hey, Britney! Huh? But there's one thing he can't control, her wardrobe. The star was out with friends in Los Angeles showing off this bright yellow bra under her white jumper. At least she was actually wearing underwear for once. See the bright side? But it doesn't matter to the paparazzi what the star wears. After avoiding the flashbulbs for a few weeks, they're just happy to see her back so they can make some money. Britney has not only attracted more media and fans on her recent outings, but also a police presence to control the chaotic scenes. But even with this team of officers on hand to help Brit get to her car after some retail therapy, the media frenzy still took place. It seems a forceful approach of her new bodyguards is helping her get through the crowds. And so you can really see the chaos that surrounds the star daily. Here's a different view. <laughs> Still thinking of becoming a celebrity? about as close to death as I've seen somebody from HAPE. He needs to go to somebody who treats pulmonary edema. What happens with pulmonary edema is that all of a sudden all of the contents of the blood vessels start leaking out. People have these frothy, congested coughs because they are literally drowning in their own blood. Going to try to contact a helicopter for tomorrow morning. Land here. Okay. Sorry. The what can't land here? The Cornali VA cannot land here. I was really quite, quite concerned that Joe might not make it through the night. Hi, number 232, right? If you can just set... You! You! Right.
right toe. Don't do it, man. Don't do it. I swear. I'll give anything. I don't uh, start bleeding. I load bleeding. Bleed, bleed. No, 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 sir. No bleed for me. I can take this. I, I'm a manly man and all that. Yeah, I'm just a kid. Give me a minute. I'm, I'm having an epiphany here. It's just kind of a big thing taking and dying, you know? Hey, my guest. You seem like a nice guy. Thanks, I do my best. Not getting you off the hook, though. Doesn't it bother you? Going around blowing people's brains out? I'm quite secure about my lifestyle choices, thank you very much. Say, so, do you have any coffee? Pardon? Coffee, I could use a cup myself. Sorry, man. <sighs> Can be helped. Now, why don't you be a good sport about this? It's late in the day for introspection. Better late than never, huh? I probably have less of my conscience than you. Just because you disapprove of this line of work, it does. Oh, come on. There's no way you can think of yourself as moral. You're biased. You wouldn't understand anyway. No, 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 no. I, I, I don't mean to be confrontational. It's just I'm curious about how you justify yourself. Are you sure now? I mean, this uh, no, yeah, I'm serious. Uh, this uh, this stuff kind of stuff fascinates me, honestly. If you put it that way. You see, I'm a Taoist. A Taoist? Yes. I read up about Taoist philosophy when it was a, a low point in my life, and it really opened up a lot. Aren't they always supposed to be nonviolent? Well, that's a traditional interpretation, but I think it goes a lot deeper than that. You see, Taoism is about accepting your place in the natural scheme of things. How's that work? I mean, life and death are part of a cycle, you know? And once you understand the world around you, you understand yourself. <laughs>